Hello, hello. Hello. Hi, Gio. How are you? Hi. Fine. Thanks. Good night, Yanira. Hello. Yanira, Eloisa. Hi, guys. Can you hear me okay? I do. All right. Perfect, Gio. So, guys, welcome to another class from Inglés Corporativo. Quiero darles la, bienven la bienvenida a una clase más, a iniciar un nuevo módulo con actitud, ¿ok? So, bienvenidos en nombre de Inglés Corporativo. So, guys, how are you today? All good? All good. Ok, fantastic. Mm -hmm. Yanira, can you hear me? Yanira. Ok, también tenemos, um, déjeme ver si me acuerdo, me sale un número nada más, 886, Jorge, Jorge Lemos, ¿qué tal Jorge? ¿Cómo Correcto. estás? Correcto, gracias bien por acá de nuevo. Ok, excellent. Are you ready for another class, guys? Yes, yeah. Fantastic, ok, so um, do me a favor, let's go to the link, ya estamos en el, en... ¿En la plataforma? Yes. All right, fantastic. So, vamos a compartir entonces el screen donde vamos a poder ver el objetivo número uno, where we are going to see objective number one. ¿Estamos todos? Hello, Mr. Mendoza. All right, so, let's do it with good attitude. Please repeat after me, lesson objective. Lesson objective. In this lesson, participants will listen to a conversation. Lesson. In this lesson, participants will listen to a conversation about how often they do an activity. About, about how, how often, often they do an activity. An activity. An activity. An an activity. activity. All right. So, en esta clase, los participantes escucharán una conversación sobre la frecuencia en que ellos realizan una actividad. All right. Tengo un voluntario para leer en inglés el objetivo. Yes, mi coach. Ok, mi perfecto. Señor Mendoza, let's go. Ok, in this lesson, participants will listen to a conversation about how often they do an activity. An activity, genial. An activity. Vamos, a, vamos a unirlo. Let's link it. An activity. An, An activity. activity. All right. Let's go. Let's do it again, Mr. Mendoza. Okay. In this lesson, participants will listen to a conversation about how often they do an activity. An activity. Excellent. Good job, sir. So let's click okay. next. Conversation. Repeat after me, please. Conversation. 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 I hardly ever exercise. I hardly, I ever, hardly exercise. ever exercise. All right, fantastic. So, welcome, William. All right, so let's go ahead and listen to the conversation. Are you ready? Yeah. All right, fantastic. Let me share with audio here. Can you hear the audio? No. All right, so give me just one second. Let me share with sound, all right? One moment, please. Can you hear now? No. no. All right, just give me a second. All right, so I got Janira. Just one moment, please. All right, so this is what we're going to do. Vamos a hacer lo siguiente. Los voy a poner en break rooms, y en los break rooms, ¿ya saben ustedes cómo compartirlo? Yes. All right, fantastic. So, vamos a ir a los break rooms. Los voy a estar visitando uno por uno. Y vamos a darle play al audio, ¿ok? Por favor, acepten la invitación. Please accept the invitation. All 
All right. So Mr. Mendoza is in. Hello, guys. Okay. Hello, hello. All right, perfect. So we have Mr. Mendoza, William, and Eloisa. Could you please share the video, please? Okay. Let's see. Okay, right. All right, go ahead and play it to see if we can hear it. Okay. Can you hear it, guys? William? Are you there, William? Maybe not. William, are you here? Oh, perhaps he can hear us. All right, just give me a second. I'll be right back. Okay. Now, in the meantime, Mr. Mendoza, listen to the audio yourself. Escúchalo usted. Okay, perfect. All right. Yo tampoco. Hi. <gasps> Teacher. <laughs> Have you been able to share the audio? ¿Pudieron compartir el audio? Eh, mm. Nosotros, bueno, yo recién voy entrando, no. Sí, yo también. No sé. ¿En qué lección no. estamos? Okay, so we are going to go to lesson number one. Okay. ¿Ya entraron a la plataforma? Ahorita. Mm. All right, si no, I'm going to share this with you, okay? Okay. All right, so once you enter the platform, you're gonna go here. It's lesson one. Mm -hmm. And we are right here. Oh, okay, okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. All right, I'm gonna go check if the other ones have access. You're really fit. Do you exercise? I don't find my course. I'm going to send the link, okay? Just, just one second. And then I often go in long skate. What about you? Oh, I hardly ever exercise. I usually just watch TV in my free time. I guess I'm a real couch baby. Mm, yeah. All right. Let me go to the other one. Just one moment. I'll be right back with you. Okay. All right, guys, so we are back. Were you able to listen to the audio? Yes. All right, fantastic. So yes. I want to share something with you. So we can, let me, let's wait for Gio and Ronnie. So I got Marcela. Thank you, Marcela, Jamira, Beatriz. All right, thank you for logging in. All right, so I'm going to be sharing with you guys adverbs of frequency. Who can tell me what an adverb of frequency is? 
¿Quién me puede decir qué es un adverbio de frecuencia? Oh, okay. Mr. Mendoza. Uh, uh, maybe uh, for me, uh, adverbs of frequency is, is a, is a when a people uh, do an activity in a middle time or a long time or every every month or every week, for example. Mm -hmm. Exactly. So every month, every week, we are talking about frequency. Estamos hablando de la frecuencia en que nosotros hacemos A o B actividad. Okay? So here, les voy a mostrar, I'm going to show you the address of frequency. Okay? Now, let's read with me, please. Everyone repeat after me, please. Always. 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 Here, acá no vamos a decir always, ni vamos a decir always. Solo bajamos un poquito la mandíbula. Oh, always. Uh, al always. Always. Very good. I always study after class. I always study after class. I always study after class. All good. Xiomara, can you please help me and read? Mm -hmm. I always study after class. I always, I always study after, after class. class. Excellent. Usually. 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 Everyone, usually. 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 I usually walk to work. I usually, I usually walk to work. Walk to work. Okay, very good. Bea, could you please help me and read? I usually walk to work. I usually walk to work. Thank you very much. Next one, I normally get good marks. I normally, normally get, good, get marks. good marks. Very good. Thank you. Gio? I normally get good marks. Excellent. Good pronunciation of the, of the S sound. I often read in bed at night. I often read in bed at night. I often read in bed at night. Very mm -hmm. yeah. good. Ronnie, can you help me and read? I often read in bed at night. Okay, very good. Let's do it here. I often, I often, 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 guys, you can say often or often, and it's the same. No hay ningún problema same. con okay. cualquiera de los dos. Okay. 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 Mm -hmm. vamos a fijarnos. We are going to work a lot. Vamos a trabajar con la unión, con nuestra pronunciación. So, I often read in bed at night. Y lo decimos junto. At night. I, I, I often read in a bed at the night. At I often read in a bed at Acá. Vamos a decir at, at. Subimos la lengua. Hace los dientes. At, y no son at, at, at night. Vamos a decir at At night. At night. At night. At night. Mm -hmm. Excellent. Thank you, Maria Jose. Roxana. Perfect. So, how do you say a veces? Sometimes. Sometimes. Very good. How do you say occasionalmente? Rarely. Rarely. Occasionalmente. Occasional. Aquí si, si pueden ver tenemos más o menos un porcentaje. Esto nadie se va a jalar de los pelos. Usted dice usually es 95 es para que tengan una idea. Déganlo conmigo de nuevo. Always. 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 Usually. 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 Normally. Normally. Generally. 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 Ahora un poquito más de fluidez. Generally. 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 Excellent. Often. 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 Frequently. Frequently. Sometimes. 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 Mm -hmm. Very good. This S that you see right here is super important. Sometimes. 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 Occasionally. Occasionally. Seldom. 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 Hardly ever. Hardly ever. Hardly ever. Rarely. 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 
Un poquito chistoso. Rarely. 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 Never. 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 So, Never. vamos a ver si alguien me puede dar los, los, los significados. How do you say siempre? Always. 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 Está bien, guys. Remember, I don't look for perfection. No busco la perfección. I look for you to try. Para que ustedes intenten, ¿ok? Um, how do you say usualmente? Usually. 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 Normalmente. Normally. 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 Generally. Generally. Normally. Generalmente. Generally. 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 Exactly. A veces. Sometimes. 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 Very good. Frequentemente. Frequently. Frequently. Often. Vamos a hacer el stress acá. Conmigo. Todos conmigo. Frequently. 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 Often es más o menos como seguido. How do you say seguido? Often. often, very good. Often or often. They are both Occasionalmente. Occasionally. 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 How do you say muy pocas veces? Hardly ever. Hardly ever. Hardly ever. Hardly ever. Hardly ever. Seldom sería. It would be muy pocas veces. Okay. ¿Cómo se dice? Seldom. 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 Very good. Seldom. Casi nunca. Hardly ever. Raramente. Rarely. 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 Never. Okay. Rarely. So now that we have a better idea, guys, let's add yeah. up the, the structure. What is the structure? Subject. Subject. Uh -huh. Adverb. 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 A bit of frequency. Adverb. Uh -huh. main Adverb. Adverb. Frequency. Okay. Main frequency. Main and main verb. So, what do you say? Yo siempre hago mi tarea. I always do my homework. I always do my homework. Yo usualmente me baño todos los días. And you usually shower every day. I usually take a shower every day. Every day. Come on, guys. You should always take a shower, not usually. Now, how do you say? I always take a shower. I always take a shower. Okay, very good, sir. How do you say? A veces. Sometimes. Sometimes. Padres. Sometimes. Uh -huh. I sometimes visit uh -huh. my sometimes. Sometimes. Uh -huh. sometimes. I sometimes visit my parents. Sometimes visit my parents. Visit my parents. Exactly. And then, yeah. uh, what happens if we have the verb to be? Who can tell me what is the verb to be? Always have. Is. Uh huh. Is. Party. Okay. And then G. Verb to be is it is. Um. Um. Is. Is. Are. Are. Is, are. Is, are. Mm -hmm. Exactly. So here. Here is the structure. We have subject. Los verbs to be, to be, be the adverb. Um, ¿Cuál es la diferencia? What is the difference? Cuando habla para una persona. Ajá. Uh -huh. Tercera persona. Mm, no. Daniel sí. sería he, ¿verdad? Mm -hmm. uh, the, the, he. The number of frequencies, the last. In the... Exactly. That is correct. The adverb frequency when you have the verb to be. Is yeah. after verb to be. So say it with me. He is, he is always, always happy. Always happy. 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 He's happy. always happy. Exactly. So how do you say? He is always angry. Ellos siempre están contentos. 
Pray Days are always, 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 always happy. Right. Days always. See, okay, let's look happy. for a victim. Let's look for a victim right here. Let's <laughs> see. I'm looking. Yesenia. Can you hear me, Yesenia? Jesse, can you hear me? Yesenia Menendez? No, I think she can. Gio, I see you. All right, Gio, help me out. How do you say ellos están siempre enojados? They are always angry. There you go. Very good. Catherine, mm -hmm. can you hear me? Yes, yes. All right, Catherine, how do you say yo nunca estoy enojada? Nunca está enojada, ¿verdad? O sí. Okay. Es que no escuché, se cortó. All right. How do you say, yo nunca estoy enojada? ¿Qué va primero, guys, en esta estructura? The subject. Uh -huh. Subject. Okay. What is the subject for yo? I, 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 I am. I am. What is the verb to be for I? Um, um, so um, I am never, 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 never angry. stay angry. Angry. angry uh -huh. Good job. Good job. Good job. I am okay. never angry. Okay, guys. Um, I'm going to stop sharing and we will continue. Or you know what? Let me go here. Give me a second, please. <laughs> Here, let's go ahead and continue and let's go to the next exercise. Okay? Read with me. Lesson objective. Lesson objective. Lesson objective. Lesson objective. Lesson objective. By the end of this lesson. lesson by the end of this by the end lesson. Of this by the end of this session, 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 we will learn how to ask an answer. By the end of the season, question using Albert's frequency. All right, fantastic. I, th I think that was JC. All right. Yeah. Um, pretty much, guys, la manera en la que vamos a leer para que todos podamos participar, lo haremos seccionado. Por ejemplo, acá, by the end of this lesson, luego seguiré lo que voy marcando, highlighting, y al final para que podamos hacer buena pronunciación, lo vamos a decir todo completo. ¿Ok? So, cuando leamos, okay. solo leamos lo que yo les digo. Let's do it again. Vamos a tratar. Let's try again. By the end of this session, by the end of this session, of this session, session, session you will learn, you will learn, will learn, will learn, will learn how, how to ask and answer questions. How to ask, how to ask, and, ask and answer questions. How to ask and answer. Y ahí lo linkeamos. How, how to, to ask, ask and answer, and answer, and answer, and answer questions. 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 Using yes. adverbs of frequency. Using adverbs of frequency. Now let's do it complete. Wait for me to finish, esperando que yo termine, and then your turn. By the end of this session, you will learn how to ask and answer questions using adverbs of frequency. Go. By the end of this session, you will learn how to ask and answer questions using adverbs of frequency. Okay, of frequency. Very good. So, I need a volunteer right here. A volunteer to read this objective. Me. Okay, who said me? Who, who, who? who said me? Ronnie. <laughs> Ronnie. All right, Ronnie, let's do it. Everything. <clears throat> okay. By the end of this session, session, you will, session, you will uh, learn how to ask and answer questions using adverbs of frequency. Good job. Good job. Good job, Ronnie. Fantastic. So, guys, al final de esta clase, thank you, Ronnie, aprenderán cómo hacer preguntas y responder usando adverbios de frecuencia. All right? So, let's go ahead and continue. Um, les quiero hacer la, la, el recordatorio prácticamente que siempre vayan ustedes siguiendo el progreso en su plataforma personalmente. Ahí es donde ustedes van a lograr su nota y donde el progreso se van guardando. Okay? So, okay. 
the next thing I'm going to do is that I'm going to share this with you. Okay? You won't hear right now. No one, no one can poder escuchar. But I want you to see. Yes. I want you to see the structure and do a quick, quick exercise. Okay? Give me just a second. All right. Here we go. Who can tell me how to ask a question? ¿Quién me puede decir cómo hacer una pregunta para poder contestar en adverse of frequency? ¿Algún valiente? Uh, ¿Any volunteer? You use adverse of mm -hmm. frequency. So we have it right here. Let's write with me. How often do you exercise? How often do you exercise? Do you exercise? Mm -hmm. Exactly. How often? How often? How often? How often? Mm -hmm. Do you exercise? All right. Do you so exercise? How exercise? Do you how often do you eat pupusas? Okay, very good. Here, as every you, day. This is <laughs> a verb in base form. Okay? El verbo lo vamos a dejar siempre en la forma base. Okay. Thank you very much for the people who are sharing. I'm checking right now the pictures. Gracias por estar compartiendo el material. Jorge and Mr. Mendoza. So welcome. how do you say, ¿Qué tan seguido estudias inglés? How often do you study English? How often do you study English? How often do you All right, so as we can see, the structure is how often. How often. Mm -hmm. Do you study English? English. 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 Subject and verb. And Remember, verb. Guys, the verb is going to be in the base form. Okay? ¿En qué tense va a estar el, el verbo? ¿Vamos a hacerlo en ING o en base? En base. 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 Basic form. Uh -huh. So, read with me. I lift weight every day. I lift weight every day. I lift weight every day. Every day. How do you say todos los días? Every day. Every, day. Every, day. Every, day. Every, day. Every day. How do you say Every day. 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 Every Every day. 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 Once a, once, a once, a once, a once a week. Once a week. Once a week. Una vez al mes. Once, once a month. month. Una vez al año. Once, once a year. year. All right. Fantastic. Dos veces al mes. Twice, twice, twice a month. Twice, twice a month. Exactly. The pronunciation is twice. 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 Twice a month. Twice. And we link it. Twice a month. Twice, twice a month. month. Twice a year. Twice a month. Twice a month. Twice a day. Twice a day. Twice a day. Twice a day. Three times a year. Two times Three times a, a, year. Year. Three times a year. How do you say tres veces a la semana? Three, Three times, times a, a year. Week. 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 How do you say tres veces al día? Three times, Three times, a, times a day. 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 Okay, how do you say, yo me lavo los dientes tres veces al día? I wash my teeth three, three times a day. Three times a day. Three times a day, correct. Now, with your teeth, the verb is brush. 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 I brush my teeth. I brush, brush my teeth. My teeth. Two times three times a day. Three times a day. Okay. Three times a day. I need a volunteer. Hey, coach. All right, very good, uh, Mr. Mendoza, right? Okay. <clears throat> I'm starting to recognize your voice. Mr. Mendoza, how do you say, yo me baño tres veces al año? Wow. No. <laughs> no. All right. I remember, guys, que uno de mis objetivos como maestro es que ustedes aprendan y que se diviertan. <laughs> Así que no quiero que le estén haciendo bullying a Mr. Mendoza por los, no por los ejercicios y ejemplos que yo le pido, ¿ok? Ok. So, uh, ¿lo quiere intentar? Yo me yes. baño tres veces al año. Ok. Ajá. Uh, sería, uh, I take a shower two times a year. Ahí está, fantastic. Thank you for participating, sir. All right. Um, so, how do you say, 
cinco veces a la semana? Five times a week. Very good. So, si Xiomara, I got you, Xiomara. Xiomara, how often do you go to school? Um, I don't go to school. <laughs> never. Good. Never. I never. I never. I go never to go to school. All right. Um, very good. Um, let me see. I got Yesenia. Can you hear me now? Jesse? Uh, it seems Jesse cannot hear me. Laura, can you hear me? Laura? Laura no está. Good song. That's a, I like that song. All right, JC, can you hear me? Yeah. All right, fantastic, JC. Um, William, I want yeah. to ask a question with how often to JC, please. Uh, repeat it, please. I want you to ask a question to JC using how often. Necesito que tú le hagas una pregunta a JC ocupando how often. Um, how often do you eat pupusas? Go, JC. Oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> I will eat pupusas uh, one a week. Once a week. Good job. Once baby. a week. Good job, William. Mm -hmm. Fantastic. All right. Yeah. Ya vamos a hacer esto en los break rooms. Solo quiero que más o menos vayan entendiendo cómo vamos. Now, read with me. Do you ever watch TV in the evening? Do you ever, Do you ever watch, watch, TV watch TV in the evening? In the evening? Um, who can translate this to Spanish? ¿Quién puede traducirlo al español? Carlos. Can you hear me? Carlos Morales. ¿Cuántas veces uh, ves televisión en la noche? La, en la tarde. Uh, en la noche. Uh, All right. Very good. No, uh, When we use uh, do you ever, it's like... ¿Alguna vez ves televisión? Ah, okay. tarde? ¿Alguna vez? ¿Alguna vez? Exactly. So, como pueden ver ustedes, ocupamos how often para cada cuánto. Cada cuánto haces ejercicio. Todos los días, una vez al mes, dos veces al mes, tres veces al año. Y tenemos la negativa, que no la cubrimos. I don't exercise very often. No me ejercicio, no me ejercito muy seguido o no me ejercito okay. mucho que sería el más ok now volviendo al do you ever how do you say alguna vez te mojas bajo la lluvia how do you say mojarse Get wet. Um, get wet, exactly. So, get wet. Wet. do you ever do you ever get wet? Get wet. In, get wet. In How do you say bajo? Under. 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 How do you say la lluvia? Rain. 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 Under the rain. Under the rain. Correct. Under so, rain. Uh, do, you do, you ever, do you ever get wet under the rain? Get wet. Do you ever get wet under the rain? Do you ever get wet under the rain? Under rain. The rain. Mm -hmm. So, see, rain. Maria Jose, can you hear me? Yeah. <laughs> Don't get scared. No se asuste. Don't leave like that. <laughs> Don't worry. So, Maria Jose, um, let me see. Carlos Morales. Yes. Could you please ask Maria Jose if she ever gets wet under mm -hmm. the rain? Le puedes preguntar a Maria Jose si alguna vez ella se, se moja bajo el agua, bajo la lluvia. Mm -hmm. Uh, yo. Yes. Okay. Uh, Maria, quiero ver. How, how ever. Do you ever. How, do you ever. Uh, get wet. Uh -huh. Get wash. wet. Te mojas. Get wet. Get wet. Uh -huh. Bajo la lluvia. Uh, behind. Under. Acá. Under. Under. The rain. The rain. <laughs> so repeat after me. Do you ever get wet under the rain? Do you ever, Do you ever get, get wet, wet under the rain? Get the wet in the rain. Do you guys, get wet under the rain. Get wet under the rain. Answer the question. 
sometimes when I don't have an umbrella. <laughs> ok, very good. So, vamos a ocupar la estructura acá. I... I sometimes, I sometimes, sometimes get wet, get get wet under, under the rain. Wet. Under the rain. Get wet under the rain. And here you can get the compliment. I sometimes get Aquí es wet donde ustedes pueden meter under the rain. Por ejemplo, I sometimes get wet under the rain when I don't, when have, an I don't have an umbrella. So everyone repeat, please. I sometimes get wet when I don't have an umbrella. When I don't have an umbrella. All right, fantastic, guys. Ahora que ya sabemos cómo hacerlo, I stop sharing, as you can see. Vamos a hacer break rooms, guys. Y quiero que se empiecen a hacer preguntas entre ustedes. Obviamente, obviously, questions with respect. All right? Esas preguntas con mucho, mucho respeto. No vayan a estar preguntando cosas que ustedes no contestaron, ¿ok? All right. All right. So, let's get with the break rooms so we can start asking questions to each other. Vamos a tener tres minutos, guys. We're going to have three minutes to ask questions to each other, ¿ok? Ok. ¿Cuánto okay. tiempo vamos a tener por, para las preguntas? Three minutes. Three minutes. Three minutes. Three minutes. Perfect. So, let me get you together. One moment, please. All right. So, please accept. Just one moment. It's closing out. All right, just one moment, please. In the meantime, let's go ahead and complete exercise. <coughs> Pueden ocupar esto de hecho. Vamos a hacer las preguntas y luego vamos a hacer el exercise 1.4, el knowledge check. Okay. okay. Mientras se cierran los break rooms, podemos empezar y ya los voy a unir de nuevo, ¿ok? Exercise 1.6. Estamos en el ejercicio 1.6. Are we in exercise 1.6? No, 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 All right, guys, please go ahead and accept the groups. Oh. All right, so I got Bea, I got Sonia, Laura. Can you hear me? Hello, girls. Can you hear me? Laura, can you hear me? Hello. Hello, teacher. All right, Sonia, are you able to, to talk to Laura? Can you hear Laura? No. No. He, he did not. She did not talk. Talk. 
Yeah. Laura, can you hear me? Yes, she's actually not talking. All right, so let me move you to another group, okay? Okay. One moment. Bea, can you hear me? Ahorita sí, ya. Yeah. All right, very good. So, déjeme agregarle a un grupo que se salió. Mm -hmm. Okay. Let me just okay. Say. All right, please go ahead and accept the invitation. Mm ¿Ya aceptó? No, no, no me sale nada. La primera vez sí me salió. Ok. So Pero me... después no sé qué pasó. All right, give me just a moment then. Let me try uh -huh. it. Ok. Hello, hello. For some reason, I cannot add you to any break room. Me sale acá, vea que ya está la invitación, ¿no le sale? No, porque la primera vez sí me salía, pero, o sea, me decía que, que usted me había invitado a un grupo y, o sea, le di a aceptar. Pero de ahí no sé qué pasó. Vamos a tratar de nuevo. Let's go ahead and try again. Uh -huh. Ahí tendría que estar saliendo otra invite, otra invitación. No, no, no me sale. Okay. Give me just a second, please. Mm -hmm. All right, vamos a... Give me just a second. Any uh -huh. question right now? Antes, porque no te puedo agregar. Me sale que te, que te llega la invitación, pero no te sale a ti la notificación. Ya Ajá, no, no bueno. me aparece a mí. All right. Antes de cerrar el, el, los chats, do you have any question about address or frequency? Mm, no, es que quizás en realidad tendría que, tengo que como practicarlo yo aparte porque sinceramente me cuesta un poquito. All right, understood. Don't worry. Un poco. Um, es una parte normal, solo tú tienes más o menos que calcular el porcentaje de tiempo que te ocupas o qué tan frecuentemente lo haces. Lo que te puede ayudar mucho es el, el, el knowledge check, el 1.4, so you can uh -huh. continue with it, okay? Uh -huh. All right, perfect. So let me close the groups. All right, so we are back. Mr. Mendoza, Yamina, Mario Jose, Sonia. All right, guys, were you able to talk and ask questions to each other? Yeah, a little bit. <laughs> a little bit, all right, fantastic. Now, in the meantime, I want you to please go ahead and complete exercise 1.4. Pudieron completar el knowledge check? I have a question. Go ahead. Um, I don't have the, the the password for my 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 material because my account is blocked. Here. Oh, your account is blocked. Okay, I'm sorry yeah. to hear that. Let me get something here. I will go ahead and report that right now. I'm sending now. an email, but uh, mm -hmm. I don't have the answer yet. Okay. Very good. Oh, here it is. I was right. looking for my pen. One, two, three, four, five. Uh huh. Yeah, normally it's from numbers one to five. Yeah. But if you do it too yeah. much, it's going to get. But the, the, the email is, is blocked. Mm hmm. Exactly. Yeah. Once that is. Yes, the count. Blocked, I need to report it. Yeah. I'm reporting it as we speak. Okay, thanks. All right. Very good, guys. Um, in the meantime, let's go ahead and. 
review the material. I'm gonna share it so we can do it together. Maria Jose, you can do it once your account is unblocked, okay? Okay. So let me go ahead and share it with you. All right, guys, so read it with me, knowledge change. Knowledge check. 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 Knowledge in which the adverb in brackets is placed correctly. In which the adverb in brackets is correctly. Is placed correctly, exactly. So everything, read the following prompts. Choose the response in which the adverb in brackets is placed correctly. Go. Read the following prompts. Choose the response in which the adverb in brackets is placed correctly. All right, very good. So let's see. I need a volunteer to read this, please. Me. Okay, go ahead. Instructions. Read the following prompt. Choose the response with, in which the adverbs in the bracket in the place correctly. Okay, fantastic. So, instrucciones, lea los siguientes puntos. Escoja la respuesta en donde los adverbios de frecuencia se encuentren en la posición correcta. Um, who can tell me what is the structure? ¿Quién me puede decir cuál es la estructura? Do you play as for... Uh -huh. Do you play? Ever? Do you play sports? Do you ever play sports? Do you ever play sports? Is that correct? Yeah. Do you ever play sports? All right. Very good. Do you ever play? In the next one, sure. I play soccer. Sure, I play soccer twice a week. Do you guys agree? Uh, yes, I, I agree. Yes. I agree. This one? Yes. No. no the last sure, one. I play soccer the twice a week. One. This one. This one. one. The last one. The last one. Okay, excellent. Six. Very good. Number three, I need a volunteer. Let me see. Marce? What do you do? Do you usually do on Saturday morning? Okay, which one? Number one, number two, or number three? Number, number one. one. Do you guys agree on this one? Yes. yes. Yeah. All right, fantastic. So once that you understand the structure, is less complicated. It's menos complicado. How do you say menos complicado? No, it's less menos. complicated. Uh -huh. Less complicated. Less complicated. Very good. Less complicated. All right, volunteer for number four. Mm -hmm. Let me see. Oh, Catherine, can you hear me? Oh, I think Catherine. What about the second one? This one? This one? Mm -hmm. Nothing much. I almost okay. always sleep until noon. Is that correct? Yeah. Let it be. Mm -hmm. Yes, it is. Exactly. Yes, it, it is, is correct. It Fantastic. Be. Good job. Number five. Mm -hmm. I need a volunteer. The second one? Do you open the. Let's go ahead and pronounce it with me. Aerobics. 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 I'm sorry. Do you often do aerobics at the gym? Correct. That is the do one. You do you? All right. Number six. No, I hardly I, ever do aerobics. No. Exactly. Let, no. let that's one. I hardly, hardly ever, ever do aerobics. 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 Do aerobics. Fantastic. Number seven, please. Do you exercise on Sunday? 
Do you always, you always exercise on Saturdays? Do you always exercise on Saturdays? All right, guys, you're very good on this. All right, number eight. No, I never exercise on Saturdays. Correct. No, I never exercise. 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 On Notice Sunday. the adverb of frequency is between the subject and the verb. Good job. Number nine and number ten. I need a volunteer for number nine. Do you? What do you do? What do you? Usually, usually do. do after exactly. class. What do you, do you usually do, do after class? What do you do after class usually? Yeah. Uh -huh. what? Number one, number two, or number three? Number one. Number one. Number one. Number one. What do you usually do after class? Do and the last one. Growl with my classmates. Yeah, I go out with my classmates about three times a week. Mm -hmm. uh, let us, let us see. I go out with my classmates about two times a week. Exactly. I go out with my classmates about three times a week. Let me tell you guys that the time expression are going to go at the end, are going to go with the complement. Okay? Generalmente, las expresiones de tiempo, como tres veces por semana, una vez al día, Siempre las vamos a poner al final de la oración. ¿Ok? Ok. So, how do you say, for example, yo siempre, yo siempre desayuno tres veces a la semana? I always, I always break, 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 break three times a week. Exactly. I always have. ¿Ok? Remember that breakfast is a noun, it's not a verb. So, I always have breakfast three times a week okay so guys any questions so far alguna pregunta que tengan acerca de los adverbios de frecuencia no it's now or never guys es ahora o nunca <laughs> only practice. No? All right, only practice. So, after each class, después de cada clase, guys, yo les aconsejo que tratemos de hacer ejercicios. Pero esos ejercicios, tratemos de hacerlos a manera personal. ¿Ok? Porque si lo ponemos a manera personal es mucho más fácil que nosotros nos acordemos. Y si lo hacemos divertido, por ejemplo, yo realmente me baño tres veces al año, se pueden acordar, ahí yo me acuerdo que tal persona dijo esto. ¿Ok? So, fantastic. Ok. Now, como tarea, guys, y esto, pues, me lo pueden enseñar con, con un screenshot en el grupo, o simplemente se lo dejo a su conciencia, podemos ocupar we can use this we can use this image, the one that I'm going to share we can use this image guys as a homework, alright and you substitute the information for your own information okay my case I Always go out with my parents. Yo okay. siempre salgo con mis padres. Eso es algo de mi vida personal, de lo que yo siempre me voy a acordar. Okay? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I never drink beers. Yo nunca oh como yeah. cerveza. <laughs> Hi. I always drink. <laughs> there you go. You see, I always drink. So, si lo hacen de una manera en la que ustedes se diviertan, se acuerdan y lo pongan en algo personal, yo les aseguro que su aprendizaje va a ser aparte de más dinámico y divertido, mucho más fuerte. Se van a acordar siempre de eso. All right? Very All good. Right. Right. Vamos a hacer un review. Let's, do, let's review quickly. What is the structure? 
Subject. 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 Okay. So, hay algunos adverbios. There are some adverbs that they can go at the beginning. Okay. Como, like, for example, sometimes, sometimes. usually, Usually. Esos dos pueden ir tanto aquí en el sanguchito, which is the subject and the preferred, like at the beginning. Okay? Okay. But in okay. your material, okay. en su material también está eso que lo vamos a ver más adelante. Les aconsejo que vayamos siempre siguiendo la plataforma porque ahí es donde ustedes van viendo su progreso. All right? All right. So, guys, yes. ¿alguna pregunta antes que los deje ir a dormir en paz? Any question? La, 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 the homework saying for email or for tomorrow in this uh, meeting. In WhatsApp. The in WhatsApp. homework, you can actually send a picture to the WhatsApp. Okay. Yes. And uh, we can also discuss it. Lo que podemos hacer es que discutimos la tarea, pero siempre les voy a pedir, guys, que tengamos un poquito de proactividad. Yo sé que a veces no tenemos tiempo, pero si podemos ver antes la presentación, Créanme que a la hora de la clase ya solo me van a venir a bombardear con preguntas. Teacher, why this? Why that? Y así ustedes ya van a tener una buena base. You're going to have a solid base, all right? All right. All right. Perfect. So, when do we use adverbs or frequency? Who can tell me that? All the right. time? Mm -hmm. Adverbs of frequency. Laura? Mm -hmm. What's the meaning of seldom? Seldom is um, muy pocas veces. Hoy se le escucho, Laurita. Ya al final, pero me, me funciona. <laughs> All right, guys. So, if you have no more questions, I would like to say thank you on behalf of Inglés Corporativo. Thank you very much for your dedication and you logging in tonight. Do your homework. Use the, the image that I share and give me one example. I always this. I seldom this. I never this. So one example of each and make it personal, okay? Well, okay. Make it personal okay. So you can remember. Okay. Uh, okay. Guys, thank you very much. And I'll see you tomorrow, same time, same place. Okay? Uh, okay. See you. Yeah. All right, guys. Okay. Have a good night. Thank you for your commitment. Thank you. Take care. Thank you. Good night. Bye. Have a good night. Bye-bye.